Hello and welcome back to the LTL Mandarin School YouTube channel. You're with Campbell. Mahin. And today we're going to show you how to get a cab in Shanghai. There are two ways. This is the first way. Okay, this is the first way, the old fashioned way. Let's go. There's one here. I think we're good. So Maureen, how are you going to be paying for this taxi? I'm going to pay with Alipay. And we have a video about this if you want to have a look. That's it. I just paid with Alipay. Clink right here. And it was only 21 yuan for like maybe 20 minutes in the taxi, so it was pretty cheap. Yeah, that's it. Hey guys, so you just saw the first way how to get a cab in Shanghai. Pretty simple, stick your hand out, flag down a cab. I'm sure that wasn't too groundbreaking because you can do that anywhere in the world. I'm going to show you the second way how to get a cab in Shanghai. This way is a little bit different. I'm going to be using an app called Didi. Now Didi is just like Uber, so the first thing you might be wondering is how am I going to pay for that? Now you can, you can use Alipay as we mentioned. Check out this video and you'll be able to see how to use Alipay to order more of a Uber style taxi. But actually with this app you can order regular taxis and pay with cash in the cab. So I'm going to show you right now. Maureen and I, we are off to Xiaolongbao right now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy and paste our favorite Xiaolongbao that's going to be the next video. Stay tuned. We're going to show you the best Xiaolong Bao in Shanghai. But for now, this is a how to get a cab in Shanghai video. So I've copied and pasted. This is the first one. And then you can see here, I'm recording my, stream, my screen. We're getting the taxi option. So there's Express, Premier. You must click taxi because you won't be able to pay for it otherwise. Taxi, call for taxi, sending requests. And there you go, a taxi is coming to me right now. Hey, so we're still waiting for our taxi. It's been about five minutes, but uh, we know he's on his way. Uh, as you can see on my screen, he's, I think he's on the other side of the street. He just needs to do a U-turn. Uh, and don't worry, you can actually see the number plate on this, uh, on this app. So we're just looking for a cab here in Shanghai. I'm looking for GW909. So, We'll keep a lookout and uh, shall and bow on the way. So there you go guys, simple as that. It is raining in Shanghai. <laughs> Hello. We made it. <laughs> so a little bit to the Okay. So, a little bit more difficult getting, well, 
just a bit of a longer wait really. We got lucky with our first taxi when Marine was hailing it. But the advantage to using this system is because I used Didi, the driver knows exactly where to go. So even if your Chinese isn't very good, you'll be on your way uh, to your destination with no problems. So guys, this is basically the end of the video. Thanks so much for watching. Now we're off to get some Xiaolongbao, not just any Xiaolongbao, the best Xiaolongbao in all of Shanghai. So that'll be the next video playing. But before we go, we just wanted to tell you about a really cool partnership which we have with another YouTube channel called Challenge Yourself. The link is on the front page of our YouTube page if you want to check out some of those videos. Uh, these two guys, Tobias and Mikkel, have come to China for 90 days and they're conducting a 90 day vlog and they're trying to challenge themselves as much as possible. So, to you boys, I set the challenge to you to get a taxi somewhere in Shanghai and use only Chinese. Good luck. Yeah.